she was ready to go and so i went to pick her up and i get there and they say that that pixie got snippy when they try to get to her ears and so like they think something was wrong with her ears because pixie started snapping at them and which was crazy and uh she never done that so that's why her whole body got shaved except her face look her whole face look still got that full beard why are you being snippy i touch your ears what's wrong where's the toy so there you go pixie go play but uh they didn't they didn't charge me for the for the grooming because they couldn't finish it which i thought was really neat uh because they could have charged me but i think the manager recognized me so i figured that's why yeah they they think it's a ear you know they said it was an ear infection but i looked and doesn't look like anything and i've done some like home remedies on her to try to help uh she hasn't complained about her ears of course how could she <laughs> her being a dog but um yeah like they couldn't cut her face because of it uh, they told me i could bring her back and they would uh take care of it but i don't know she kind of looks funny the way she looks like completely shaved and her whole face look well she's wanting to play yeah i gotta take her to a vet if she doesn't get better but don't think anything's wrong because she doesn't whine or anything so it just is what it is uh, today i'm getting uh no so I just try to come in on my live uh today i'm rocking a saint's jersey who that steve gleason uh a famous special teamer of the saints saints play in about an hour so uh that's why i'm rocking the saint's jersey today um i'm gonna only be on here for a minute i have a you know i want to watch the game and then i got a friend coming over so uh so i'm just i felt like getting on live just for a little bit I hadn't been on in a couple weeks uh, started work uh school's going good you know uh kids came back friday for the first time uh but monday is like the first official day to where like all the kids will be there and um you know that's when school like officially starts in my head uh thanks for the gifts guys how's everybody doing today the first week back's rough for a teacher yeah yeah you're right you're right uh you know it's cool seeing everybody oh i appreciate that bake burr and i say the name right thank you for the hot dog thing uh yeah first week's always the roughest for a teacher because it's like you got to get back in the groove um but i had a good day on friday kids came friday um you know we had a good time had a good day so you know i got a good class that's all i can really say about it um uh, y'all notice i'm wearing different glasses uh, i'm wearing my second set because little miss picks over here decided she was gonna grab my glasses that fell on the floor yeah you you look at her who me yeah you grabbed my glasses about a week ago and destroyed them I uh, got home from work, took my glasses off, was changing, you know, getting ready for the, you know, the night or whatever, and I went and showered, and I came back, and Pixie was, Pixie was chewing on this, and she had done some numbers on that. You see the chew marks on the glasses part? Yeah, this is my favorite set of glasses. I don't know why I like these glasses so much, but rest in peace these glasses have had it see the two marks and i wasn't happy about it because i loved these glasses and then i put on these it was my second set and they hurt my eyes for about 30 minutes because they were stronger i guess i don't know i had to get used to them and i was not happy with little miss pixie for about 30 minutes but i couldn't stay mad at pixie long i oh, appreciate it. they look great on you uh what scent i got some different scented candles i like different little sets and i think that one's like peach or something i don't know uh you have three pair chewed up that was funny karina how you doing there's teddy bear i like that 
Am I catching a cold? I don't think so. I'm just, you know, it's it's hot in Louisiana and it feels good in my apartment. What is it, Pixie? Huh? Give me that. Give me that. Go get it. Uh, congrats on the daughter. Come on, guys. Uh, yeah, I knew it was a girl a while ago. Uh, so did Gypsy. Like, so did everybody. If you knew anything about Gypsy, you knew that it was a girl. I mean, everybody knew, knew that. So, I didn't think the point. I didn't know. Like, honestly, I get why you do a gender reveal, but if you already know, then what's the point? Like, that's my opinion. But, not worried about it. But, uh, yeah, I saw the, they had a gender reveal today. I knew that, but. I'll go for there. Stop the drama. I ain't in no drama. I stay away from drama, just so y'all know. Hey, Sophie, how you doing? Uh, I just love Ryan. Appreciate that. Miss Marks, thank you for the corgi. Uh, let's see. No, I like the, the glasses thing on my new. Thank you, Ruby. Uh, guys, I haven't really talked about the pregnancy much. I uh, have thoughts on it. You know, like, it's been confusing. I don't, I don't really talk about it because I don't know what to think about certain things. I uh, love I love these comments. Where's my sweat towel? Yeah, it's at your mama's house. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I saw... How many of y'all saw that um, pop culture ringtone thing that that dude did where I'm like doing this and throwing punches? That was hilarious. Like... That was hilarious. Anybody ever see it? Like, because that was hilarious. I enjoyed the hell out of that. I showed uh, one of my coworkers at work. She laughed hard, too. Honey Bunny, thank you for that. And uh, I laughed so hard when I saw that. I said, you know, of course, they got to throw in when I called him a punk ass, but I got to watch my mouth on these things. Uh, I done showed y'all the sweat towels at your mama's house. I done told y'all that. Oh, I appreciate that, sugar. Oh, that's a cool one. It looked like uh, you'd have a, like a New Orleans feel to it. That was cool. Uh, let's see. I made your boyfriend laugh on that one? Good. I just hate stupid comments. People are stupid sometimes. <laughs> I'm not really going to talk about the pregnancy, guys. Like, I know she's having a girl, though. And that's good for her. Like, what y'all want me to say on that? I mean, divorce is happening. That's all I know. Do a poll. People want me to do a poll. Pixie, why are you being grouchy? Why are you being grouchy right now? Look at that face. Look at that mouth wide open. Why are you being grouchy? Why are you being grouchy? You done tore up my glasses. What else you need? What else? Look at that. I love that they kept her tail bushy. I like pixie's bushy tail but i wanted like i'm mad about the haircut only because i wanted her eyes to get cut like i feel like pixie can't see like i'm always like getting the hair out of her eyes pixie you grouchy right now huh mama yeah yeah and he found out you weren't gonna be the only girl in gypsy's life huh <laughs> sorry <laughs> i like being an idiot but you know, uh, ow, no, Pixie, come on now, quit, play with your toy. Ow, she got me on that one. Oh, Deluxe, thank you for that. What is that? That's cool. Uh, you know, let's see, why would I announce what before her? I haven't announced anything, I haven't announced anything. So, I like that comment. That was funny. Guys, I'm not going to talk bad about what's his face today. Like, uh, it seems to get me in trouble when I do. Uh, and so, I'm not going to do it. I don't really get in trouble, trouble. Uh, I will say this. One lady 
like on my last one where I called him a, a punk ass or whatever, lady like tried to create drama at my work over it. Some lady in England was like, "Come on, really? Get a life, lady." If one person can tell him to get, one, if one person can tell Ken to get a job and like have an opinion on it, it's me. Just for the record, I can tell Ken to do that. Let's do a poll. Nah. Ow, Pixie, stop. Why are you being grouchy? Stop being grouchy. I know you want to play. Go play. Mm, God, she just bit me. I love you too. I love that people say that. Uh, guys, I am going to have to get a DNA test. I've already told y'all that. Uh, just because it's Louisiana law. And I have to. You know, it just is what it is since we're going through a divorce. And technically, um, it's so weird. Like, the situation is so weird. Karina, thank you for the good evening. Um, so, such a weird situation to be in. I never thought I'd be in this this ordeal like it's so crazy uh and so yeah that's things i have to do for this divorce is crazy but here's what it is guys like uh what if the baby's mine i'm not going to talk about that i've heard so many different things like I, I don't even know what to believe honestly support me thank you for the support guys thank you for the support I love that people want me to do a poll. I'm not going to do a poll. Uh, hi from Houston. How you doing, Houston? Uh, what was I going to say? I was going to say something else. I had something else to say. Oh, video about the court thing. Uh, I saw somebody did a video where I didn't show up to court. Uh, guys, I didn't have to show up. That was my first day back to work, and I didn't have to show up. Like, my lawyer and her lawyer discussed it, and it was just, it was a court, it was court to stop our community regime where, you know, where we're no longer considered, like, financially together. So it stopped that. That's all it was. Somebody told me that, that Christy got up there on the stand and, started saying a bunch of this and that this and that but honestly it didn't say honestly you know she could have gone up there hello hey, hey you might like come up for me yeah all right so nice seeing you mind exiting mind exiting yeah no you mind exiting like getting off my life okay all right, bye. Okay. Kya bol raha hai? I didn't understand what he was saying. All right, I need you to get off. I need you to leave. Thank you. God, I can't stand when I accidentally do that. God, I hit the accept button again. I hate that. I know I should have been nicer, but... Like, if I accidentally accepted, like, I was doing the decline, like, don't show again for 10 minutes, and instead of decline, I hit accept. And I thought I was, yeah, I was rude, because, come on. If she'd have got on there and said something, it might have been, might have been better, but she just looked at me. I have no patience. <laughs> Guys, I, I didn't mean to accept her. I was so rude. Come on. You don't think it's rude to try to join my live not even knowing me? You don't think that's rude? Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Uh, it was just so random. If she'd have got on there and like said something and done something, I would have probably talked to her. But when she just sit there and looked at me, like that's weird to me. Hey, Karina, thank you for the ice cream. Uh, I got on uh, Steve Gleason, Saints Jersey. Uh... I am rude. Okay. Uh, anyway, uh, Saints play tonight, and so I'm rocking the Saints jersey tonight. Uh, let's see. Random people do that to battle. What is there to battle? Like, what do you do? Just sit there and blah, 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 blah? I'm not going to sit there and do that. And those who are Team Ken, good for you. I mean, I'm happy. 
I support the LGBTQ. Oh. <laughs> God, I'm so mean. I am just playing. Who dat? I saw the who dat. I hope somebody laughed at that joke because that was funny to me. Uh, Jimmy, thank you for that. Thank you all for the gifts. Appreciate it. Uh, but, you know, guys, I hope you all have a good week. Like, had a good week. I had a good week. Started work two weeks ago. That's why I haven't done lives or done videos or nothing. I uh, just kind of been doing my own thing. Uh, you know, I don't always have to get on a live. We don't always have to do stuff. Sometimes I like taking a break from social media. And, uh, yes, ma'am. Need something? What is it? <laughs> I love Pixie. All right, you ready? You ready? Go get it. Yep. Yeah. yeah, she wants to play. Let's see. What is it, Pix? Look. See, look. I wish they had to cut her eyes. Like, at least like trimmed her eyes so like she could see like i really want her to see i can't believe i accepted that girl on live I've, that's the second time i've done that and i don't mean to do it uh you know yeah pixie's adorable guys like just look at that little tail my little bushy tail although I will do a poll. All right, my only poll I'm going to do tonight. All right, do you like Pixie with more hair or less hair? Like you like her hair cut or you like it when she's shaggy? Shaggy would be red, uh, cut is blue. Do you like Pixie with more hair or less hair? Red is shaggy, blue is her current haircut, like shaved. What y'all think? I'm not going to lie. If I was voting, I'd pick red. I like her all shaggy and look like a dust ball, like a dust, like a duster, but so hot for her. A lot of people like to cut. It's not an even poll. It's probably the only poll y'all get tonight, guys. Dust Bunny, I love her as a little, like, all shit up, like shit up where she's, you know, all dusty, not dusty, all hairy and furry and stuff. I think she's cuter that way. She looks so small right now. Like, Pixie is so tiny without with a haircut. But, this is what it is. Hi from England. That's cool. Esmeralda, thank you for the fireworks. That was cool. Guys, I do have a big jer jersey collection. I saw somebody say, uh, uh, show the jersey collection. I will. Uh, what I'll do is I'll get them all washed and I'll take care of See, I got some like hanging on my on my chair where I take Pixie for a walk. I'll throw one on or whatever and I'll get them all and I'll hang them up, make them look nice and I'll do a do a do a thing. I do have a Mavs jersey. Uh, I saw that comment. Show the fridge. Nah. Uh, let's see. Why didn't I show up to court? I didn't have to. Like, guys, it wasn't a big deal. All it did, court was just to end our community regime to where we were no longer financially a couple. Does that make sense? And that's, that's all court was. Uh, nothing happened. You know, like I said, our Christy guy on the stand, she had to be a witness. All they had to do was say that me and Gypsy haven't lived together for 30 days. You know, in that, like, we've been apart more than 30 days. We haven't lived together. So that's all court was meaning to be. Um, it was my first day back to work. You know, I I could have went, but at the same time, it was pointless to go. Like, the three and a half hours away, it had cost me money. It had cost my attorney money. Like, it would have been pointless. Like, all they had to do, Gypsy and then Christy testify that we hadn't lived together for 30 days. And, um... That just, that's all I can say. That's all it was. So, I didn't have to go. I saw somebody, ooh, what is that, a duck hat? That's pretty cool. I've never seen that. I like that. No, I don't follow Nina, but I know Nina follows me, and, you know, she does what she does. Um, but I don't watch those videos. I get comments, like, people send them to me in my activities. And I, I look at it for two seconds, and I saw where somebody was like, Ryan didn't show up to court. He's in big trouble. And 
I'm not. Why are you so fussy? Where's your toy? Where's your toy? <laughs> that underbite. Look. Where's your toy? Where's your toy? Okay. Go play. Go play. So, how have I been? Guys, I've been all right. Like, I'm making it the best I can. Uh, hey, from Arkansas. I used to live in Arkansas. Uh, I lived in Arkansas for three or four years. Probably four years. Lived up there with my dad when I was like 19. Team Ryan, thank y'all for being Team Ryan. Uh, my birthday is in June. Matthew, thank you for the good evening. Hi from Trinidad. Wow. That'd be cool to go to. Jody, thank you for that. Hi from Memphis. I've been to Memphis a bunch. Uh, me and my dad, rest in peace, used to go to the, you know, like when I moved up there at 19, uh, we used to go to the dog track, like a Greyhound where they race and you bet on them. Now, I'm not for the dog abuse or anything like that. But it's kind of cool to see them race. And we did that a couple times. That was in West Memphis. That was Arkansas, but it's still Memphis. I've been to Memphis a bunch, too. Memphis was great. Memphis on Beale Street. Memphis is cool. Like, New Orleans has Bourbon Street. Memphis has Beale Street. You know, like, they got a lot of cool bars and stuff on Beale Street. A long time ago, guys. Hi from Virginia. Been to Virginia. Pixie, you are being violent. She just jumped at my hand. Where's her toy? Pixie, play with Sarah. Here. I don't know why she's being grouchy right now. I don't know why she's being grouchy. I took her for a walk before I got on live. She just wants to play. Hi from Canada. Love to go to Canada. Never been. Would love to go to Canada. Good morning from Australia. Is it morning over there? Wow. Guys, have y'all been watching the Olympics? Olympics are like over. Uh, I watched the uh, girls' soccer game to this morning. Uh, I like soccer for some reason. I like, I, well, I take that back. I don't like like Major League Soccer or Premier League or Euro or anything like that. I just like the World Cup and the Olympics. Like, I like international play. And I'll say that. Uh, let's see. Uh, from guy from France. If you're from France, you go to the Olympics. That would be cool. I've always wanted to go to the Olympics. Like it would be cool to like go to the Olympics and, of course, to compete. But <laughs> I don't know what I compete in. But uh, be cool to just go and experience it. You know. Not uh, from Iceland. Saw so saw so, so that. You know. Hi from San Antonio. Been to San Antonio a lot. Been to San Antonio a lot. Uh, let's see, comments are moving so fast. Fayette, Fayetteville. I used to drive through Fayetteville. Uh, Bentonville, Fayetteville. Used to drive through there to go see Gypsy a lot. Never been like to stay. Actually, I stayed in a hotel in Fayetteville a couple times. Take that back. Hi from Baltimore. Been to the been to Baltimore. I saw somebody say, "Did you take me to the Olympics?" Really? That'd be cool. I'd go. Hell yeah, I'd go. Hey, from Ireland, that would be cool. Hey, happy birthday, whoever that was. I didn't see it. Uh, Aloha from Maui. He's too big for the Olympics. Duh. Like, what would I do? Track and field? Are you a moron? <laughs> I love when people are do stupid comments. You're stupid. Uh, like I just said, I couldn't compete in the Olympics. I would like to go, like, to watch them. Been to Myrtle Beach. That was cool. Uh, let's see. I want to date you. Oh, that's... Got another invite. I almost said it. Uh, yeah, I'm turning off the go invitation. Am I excited? It's a girl. Guys, <laughs> I'm not even going to comment. Not even going to say nothing on that. But... I'm excited the Saints game comes on soon. I will say that. But, you know, guys, this first live I've done in a while. 
So, Pixie, what are you doing? There's so many things I want to say. But at the same time, I'm trying not to because I don't... Like, what's the point? You know what I'm saying? Like, what's the point? And those, that's good. Why are you even going live? Because I just want to get on here and hang out for a minute. You know, just wanted to hang out. I am going to have to do a DNA test regardless. I will have to do a DNA test regardless, guys. Like, just, it is what it, like, I know I say it is what it is a lot, but I, I hate being in this situation. I will say that I hate being in this situation. And of course, you know, you know, I see a lot of comments. Do I still miss Gypsy and things like that? You gotta realize that was, that was my wife. Like I did marry her, you know, so, you know, I just, you know, I'm always going to have love for Gypsy. You know, I married her like, all right, I will say this. All right, I see, like, I get on TikTok and I see all these lives where people are like doing like a live and go, the fall of Gypsy Rose or like Gypsy's going down or, you know, people do lives where they just bash her nonstop. And I don't get it. Like, all right, these people are bashing somebody who didn't do anything to them. If anybody should be bashing her, it should be me. Like, she's done more to me than she's done to all those people hosting lives, you know. Um, so I just don't get the hate. Like, if I can overlook it and, like, just accept things the way they are, like, I just don't get it. Like, it's one of those, I, I just don't get why people do that nonstop. Um where they try to, you know, because I see this one lady always gets on there. It's like the fall of Gypsy Rose. And like, it's like, come on, really? You have nothing better else to do? You know, it's like the lady who from England said something about my live uh, last time I did a live and they like tried to get me in trouble at work. Like, really? Like, you have nothing better to do? It's just whatever. Like, people are silly, I guess. But, I guess it's, you know, like, that's the things is, like, if I'm not bashing Gypsy, why do y'all feel the need to, like, people who make those lives? I get it. Like, we did a show, and we let people in on our personal life. You know, it's, like, our fault for that. And I understand. You know, I understand my role in it. Um, you know, the reality was I was, I married her. And I, to be with her, like, she had already signed up for these shows. So it's one of those where, like, you know, I tried to, it was like, I'd always try to talk her before she got out to be like, are you sure you want to do this? Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you sure? And I'd always be like, I will support you no matter what. Like, if you want to do it, we'll do it. But at the same time, like, if she'd have said, no, I don't want to, like, I'd have been cool with that too. Like one of the last times I talked to her, she was like, I made you famous. So you need to be thankful for that. And I told her straight up, I said, I didn't want to be famous. Like, that's not what I wanted. You know, like that's not my goal in being with you. And, and guys, y'all can, I love people think that I'm clout chasing or whatever, but let me ask you this. How many podcasts have I done without gypsy? I give you the answer. Zero. I uh, notice, see, like, why would I do that? You know, I'm not getting on other people's TikTok lives and making, you know, da 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 da. Yeah, she's more infamous. I guarantee that. I give you that. I give you that. Because I used to say I married somebody infamous. I give you that. Uh, so, you know, it just is what it is. That's my little rant for the day. Uh, I am the bigger person. Like, obviously, look at me, but. <laughs> I am a big dude, but it is what it is. Uh, stay strong, brother. I appreciate it. I did a poll earlier. I'm not doing a poll again. I'm not doing another one. 
move on. Well, why don't you come make me? I love people like that. School's been great. Um, I will say this. I, my para, who I work with, I couldn't do what I do at school without my para. Okay? Like, as a special ed teacher, paras need love. Like, they they deserve everybody's respect in the school because they do a lot and I appreciate my para very much so if you're out there watching I appreciate you and I appreciate all those all the paras out there because it's a hard job and I do appreciate it a para is the person who helps me in class like she's not the teacher but she is there to help with the special needs kids and but like they are a teacher like I call my my classroom, me and her, me and my para's classroom, because without my para, it's P-A-R, paraprofessional, that's what basically what it is, uh, I couldn't, it's a paraprofessional, uh, it's like an assistant teacher, yeah, it's like an assistant teacher, but uh, me being a special education teacher, I couldn't do what I do without my para, so just giving some love out there, if y'all have paras out there, paraprofessionals, appreciate it. Uh, no, I'm not a Gemini. I'm a Cancer. <laughs> I just saw some of my parodies. That was good. Whoever said that, that was funny. I like when people make me laugh. That was good. Guys, I'm not going to look at the crime photos. I'm not. I don't need to see them. What's the point? That's why, that's why Nick's in jail for the rest of his life. I mean, y'all want my honest opinion? I don't need to look at those. That's why Nick's in jail the rest of his life. Y'all can say whatever you want on that. Uh, you know, but, you know, he traveled multiple states down, and that's why he is where he is. I'm not a, I'm not, just because me and Gypsy are no longer together right now and stuff, I'm not going to ever, like, jump on Nick's bandwagon. He did what he did. He's where he needs to be. The end of story. And that's all I'm going to say on that. I uh, appreciate the watermelon love uh, right now and stuff. I, I just didn't, you know, that's funny. People are right now. No, I just meant, meant since me and Gypsy are not together right now, so we're not together. That's all I meant. Uh, I'm from Maine. I've been to Maine. I've actually been to Maine. I ate Maine lobsters one time. Uh, I was in the sixth grade. It was a cool trip. I uh, we went to Boston and we drove up to Maine. What football team do I support? I am an LSU Tiger and a New Orleans Saint. Who that? Go Tigers and who that? I'm from Louisiana. Guys, I'm, you know, it's funny. I buy jerseys of different teams just because I like jerseys. I like collecting jerseys. I like wearing jerseys. But, like, if the Mavericks game came on and it's regular season, not playoffs, I'm not going to watch it. I only, I only watch my teams religiously, and that's LSU, New Orleans Saints. And I like the Astros. When the Astros are on, I'll watch the Astros. Those are like, those are the teams I have the most jerseys for, is the Saints and Astros. And I used to have a bunch of LSU jerseys, but I don't have them anymore. I don't know what happened to them. I was a lot younger, though. Let's see. Guys, I do appreciate all the gifts and stuff that y'all are giving. And, uh, guys, I appreciate the support. Like, really, I know there's people who hate on me, and I get that. Um, you know, but I, I do appreciate it. And I know the show, uh, they tried really hard to make me look bad. And I get why, because she ended up leaving, and, and like, the company supports her. She's the star, not me, so... You want me to stop talking? What? Look at that underbite. What? She's being grouchy. She wants to like sit in my lap and go to sleep. She wants to she wants to lay down. What? Go lay down. You don't always have to sit in my lap to lay down. Go lay down. Look at that face. See, like, look, they got all the way, the people who groomed her, they got all the way 
to the ears and then stopped. You are being fussy this live, and I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay? I don't like it. You need to stop. She's being fussy. She's jealous? Yeah, Pixie's jealous that I'm talking. <laughs> That's right. I didn't think about that. Good call. Let me give her a treat. Maybe that'll feel better. You want a treat? Come on. Let's go get a treat. Come on. Where you at? Come on. Look, I'm that hard of a Saints fan. Look, I got all my Saints. Saints slippers. Like, that's how much I love the Saints. I got on Saints slippers. Let's see. All right, Pixie, you can have a treat. You can have a treat. All right, you ready? Sit. Show the people that you know how to sit. Good girl. Good girl. No, that's a new, that's one I've been working on. Up. Oh. Oh, she knows to sit first though. Well, chew it up. Up. Oh. Dad, a girl, come here, come here. No. <laughs> he ain't that a girl. All right, Pixie doing tricks. Doing tricks. Pixie's doing tricks. You love Ken. Good for you. You love Ken. When, I mean, good for y'all. I love the person who constantly does that. Team Ken, we love Ken. I'm glad that that community loves Ken. Good for that. Uh, but hopefully if you're here and with me, you're Team Ryan. If not, then, then what are you watching for? If you're not Team Ryan, so... Happy birthday, Gracie. Uh, let's see. Come watch English football. That'd be cool. Like that's soccer, right? Yeah, football is everywhere in the world. And so, uh, yeah. Hey, from Oklahoma. Never been driven through Oklahoma. Never actually been and stopped. <laughs> So, let's go watch WrestleMania together. I've been to two WrestleManias. I would love to go to WrestleMania again. Like, you know, uh, we almost went to WrestleMania this year, but I was like, no, let's save money. So, <laughs> uh, thank you for the gift, Skyler. I think I read that right. Uh, do a poll. No, I'm not going to do a poll. Somebody was calling. I don't know. Why so much Fort Lee? Guys, Fort Lee is a Louisiana... It's a French cross, basically. It's it's a Louisiana symbol. And like New Orleans Saints, look. That's got a Florida Lee on it. Like the Saints, that's the Saints logo. It's one reason I like him, like the Florida Lees. And it's a Louisiana thing. So, just it is what it is. WrestleMania is going to Vegas, right? Is that where it's going to be? <laughs> quit calling. Whoever's calling, quit calling. I love when I get on lives, people start calling me. I'm just like, stop. Uh, that's just my ringtone for people I don't know. So, therefore, you know. Team Ryan, appreciate that, Deanna. Appreciate that. It's my birthday. Wish you a happy birthday. If it's your birthday, happy birthday. Uh, <laughs> I like Gypsy. Stop calling. That's funny. You know, y'all think she still contacts me? Let me do a poll on that. I will do a poll. Last poll. Do you think Gypsy still contacts me? Yeah, red is yes, blue is no. Do you think she still contacts me? I kind of wonder what y'all think. Red is yes, blue is no. Do y'all think she still contacts me? Reaches out. Majority says yes. Just curious. Just curious. Why wouldn't she reach out to me, right? <laughs> Why wouldn't she reach out to somebody as awesome as me? She misses our king, Ryan. That's funny. Uh, <laughs> I like messing with y'all. Uh,
does Gypsy make me stay quiet about stuff? I will let y'all know this. Gypsy is worried about things I might say. She had told me that a long time ago, though. She didn't when we first split. She's worried about things I might say or do. Uh, she knows I'm a loose cannon sometimes. Like, if I get mad, like the respecting video, I did that when I was really mad. Uh, so, I, yeah, I'm a loose cannon sometimes, like, when I get really mad. So, yeah. I do know that she worried about things I might say. So, uh, just say it. Yeah, right. I love that everybody wants to spill the tea and stuff. I get why y'all want to know, but no. Pickup is not an emergency. Nope. If it was an emergency, the person calling me, they call from an actual number. Cole, hey Cole, how you doing? I just did a poll. I'm not doing another poll. Why don't you go live and do your own polls? <laughs> go home and do your own polls. Get it? Now, uh, somebody probably was like, uh, the person probably called me. He's like, answer. They want me to answer the phone. I'm not going to answer. Let me ask you this. If I answer a phone while I'm on here, would it, like, throw live off? I'm just curious. I don't know. I don't know. It pauses you? Okay. Well, that's why I won't answer then. Because, like, that's not cool just to pause, y'all. Be like, that eh, person went away. I don't want to do that. Let's see. I've been on here for about 45 minutes, guys. Saints game's coming on soon. Uh, Chiefs or Jaguars? Guys, I will root for the Jags. I'm, I don't... I'm tired of the Chiefs always winning. Chiefs win. And uh, Super Bowl, Chiefs won. And, you know... Ugh. Chiefs. I ain't mad at you, but, you know. Uh, guys, I don't know. I don't know if there's going to be another season or not. Uh, if there is, I probably won't be in it. Uh, just why would I be, really? Uh, I mean, I'm sure they'll probably do updates with me. Uh you know, but I, I don't know if there is. I don't know. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, so, you know, if y'all liked me in the show, guys, I really appreciate it. Like, I really support. I thank y'all for the support and love. I hope y'all are smart enough to overlook some of the things they did uh, on the show because they they had to make me look bad. Like, uh, y'all hear Pixie doing that? That's how she howls at 3 o'clock in the morning. She hears other dogs and says, So, anyway. Uh, hey, Emma, how you doing? Hey, Courtney, how you doing? Oh, one thing. Did y'all see the video that I commented on about the cake, the smash cake that those girls did? And my face was like, my my <laughs> the stick they had me on was like taller than everybody else. Like, that was hilarious to me. And I commented, like, I'm so tall, and thank you, girls. That was so cute. Like, I, I thought that was amazing that the girls did that. Like, I don't even know who they are, but I appreciate the love. Like, it was just funny. Like, everybody else is all modeled pictures and, you know, some sitting there with no shirts on and stuff like that. And mine's just like a goofy-looking face when I was in New York. It was just funny. Uh, you know, I just thought that was funny. Uh, black and white jersey is my color maybe it's Saints colors I love the Saints colors yeah Gypsy is having a girl yeah she's having a girl I already knew that so good for her I ain't mad at her Thank y'all for the gift, Jimmy. Thank you. Wow. 
That many roses, Jimmy Speed. I can't see the full name. I need my own reality show. About what? Like, I'm just a normal dude who, you know, I didn't show up to court because I didn't have to, guys. It wasn't like the finale thing. It was to end the, the community regime. That's all it was. Like, I didn't have to go. Now, I'll be at all the other court hearings because, like, I, I have to go, you know. Uh, how do I watch the NFL game? NFL, like, it's a local team, so I'll get to watch the Saints on TV. Just be local. Jimmy Spoo, still, good God, man. How many roses you going to give me? It's like, he's an almost at like 3,000 roses, man. Appreciate the love, man. If you want to give me a gift, give me one that like shows up on the, on the thing. Like that. Daryl, appreciate it. Karina, I always love the gifts. Thank you. Uh, Jimmy's still giving him roses. <laughs> Uh, it's funny guys y'all seen it live where that dude is screaming at the thing it was like the Suave show or something and he's like he wears the pink wig and he just screams at the thing that I don't want that on my face I find that hilarious when he does that when he screams like that at it it's hilarious because he wants the gifts it's funny but I love it like it's, I watch it and then I move on. But it's just funny how he screams at everybody. Let's see. Hey, it's your birthday. I missed the name. I would have said it. Hey, I missed it. As I appreciate all the support. Like, TJ, hey, how you doing? Uh, guys, I will do, I will talk about the pregnancy in depth soon. Um, you know, I've said that I have to get a DNA test. I have to do that for court. Um, but I will go in depth of my thoughts. Like, you know, guys, like the way the timeline matches up, it just, it, it just, I, in my opinion, I don't think it's mine, but I don't know. Like, uh, the DNA test is going to prove it, but. That's all I'm gonna say. Like that's that's it. I, I don't like crazier things have happened. I just don't know. I don't know, and I don't want to go in depth with it because I just don't know. Like I have my thoughts, I have my opinions. Like, I, but that's the end of that. I'm done with that. And there's Pixie. Pixie sitting on a blanket. She heard him dog, so she's looking, look, she's protecting. You gonna protect? Love that dog. I oh, appreciate that, Tony. Dinosaur. Thank y'all. Pop culture, thank you. Were you the one that is that the dude that sent the pop culture tunes? Did y'all see that? Tune where I'm sitting there doing the boxing thing and it's like, you don't wanna come to Lake Charles, you know, leave Jip at home. That was so hilarious I loved it like it was hilarious to me I'm not going to answer if we still talk I did a poll that says you know what do you think and that's all I'm going to say uh, guys they're not going to have me on Bachelor just so you know like I get people I see that comment Ryan for Bachelor they, they don't want somebody as big as me on there as far as like how big I am. And they're all supermodels. I know I'm awesome. Uh, and guys, y'all can say that's whatever, but I'm confident. As a guy, you have to be confident. So I just, I like me. I like, I look in the mirror and I like myself. So it is what it is. Uh, so going to love Island cut a promo I like that cut a promo it would be a wrestling promo I could be like Hulk Hogan let me tell you something brother do one of those uh, do a wrestling promo on Ken that's kind of funny I don't know who I would do but uh, I 
There's so many comments. I'm trying to read them. I want to say hey to the people who want me to say hey. Karina, thank you for the gifts. Jimmy, thank you again. Hasil, did I say that right? She's given a bunch of gifts this live. Hasil, appreciate you. Uh, hey, Leah, how you doing? Uh, hey, Lena, how you doing? Guys, I'm just saying hey for a minute. Live from Love from Alabama. Uh, hey, it's Emily Potter. Okay, hey. Uh, Roll Tide, I will never say that. That's the only Roll Tide y'all will ever hear me say is somebody doing the comments. I'm a Go Tigers guy. Go Tigers. I was at the game, last one where LSU won. Uh, beat Alabama in OT, went for two and got it. It was awesome. I'm kind of excited to go to LSU games this year. Like, I always go to LSU football games, and I'm so excited. I just I'm, – I'm very excited. Can you say go Tigers, go Tigers? Uh, so I'm, I'm excited. Hey, Allie. I just saw Hey, Allie. Everybody's telling me to watch Becca Scoops. I'm not going to watch that lady. Go Vols. I've been to their stadium. Like, Tennessee's got a cool stadium. It's just weird how Ryan watched the boys. I love the show, The Boys. That show is so friggin' good. Good God. I've watched, I binge watched it right before school started. And I'm on the last season. But The Boys, guys, if y'all want a good show, it's crazy and out there. And it's like how superheroes, if they were all corporate, and like all the saves that they make against people are like already set up by the company like it's so good like watch the show if you're out there watch that show uh yeah it's amazing pixie is like nine months now maybe no yeah got her in january and she was like six months old six weeks old eight weeks old uh danielle thank you for the gift I always like seeing the cool little gifts. Uh, hey, Harmony, how you doing? I like World Cup soccer, things like that. Let's redecorate my room. I'll be up for it. Up for redecoration. <laughs> up for that. Hi, right, guys. Saints game's coming on soon. Who dat? Guys, thank you all again for the love. Uh, it's my first live in like two weeks. Uh just want to get on here and say, hey, guys, uh, you know, got a friend coming over. Should be here any minute. So, uh, guys, love y'all. Thank y'all for the support. I uh, hope y'all enjoyed my live. Um, hey, Raven, how you doing? Uh, you know, it's funny. I love people saying we don't care, but you're on my live. So, Karina, thank you. I see you. Thank you. Jimmy, Speed, whatever. Thank you for the love. Brittany, thank you. Guys. Y'all have a great night. Uh, I might come back on live after the Saints game. Uh, you know, who knows, guys. Uh, love you guys. Thank y'all for the love. Bye, guys. Pixie, it's time to go. I know you're ready.